looks like we're coming up on a blue giant. From Aya, it's often the brightest star, the first to rise. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. emissions from the black hole are incredible out here. The song of the dark side of creation. I'm picking up something. Probes launched. Anomaly found. Picking up something. Probes launched. I found something. Thank you. 
after the Tecunas expedition, the first Salarians to reach the Citadel. It's a big name to live up to. Anomaly detected. Deploying probe. Anomaly found. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Anomaly on sensors. Probe away. Satellite detected. Andros. Sam warned us about Knight's attack. Unfortunately, one device triggered already. We lost a chunk of hydroponics. Watch your tone. Sorry, Candros. I had to help someone out. Where's Knight? We're tracking her down, but those devices are still alive. I need you to take care of them. Quiet. We can't afford panic.
after me. Your incompetence isn't my problem. Just do your job. What do you want? Whatever's going on, it's not fair to take it out on me. <sighs> Apologies, you're right. This is not your fault. I haven't heard much good about that guy. Whatever you've heard, it's not half as bad as the reality. Just last week, he tried to redirect some of the supplies we need to keep the stasis pods going. Why? I have no idea. But if Kesh hadn't stepped in and threatened to airlock him, it would have been a disaster. He's always like that. Making bad decisions, driving the Krogan away, treating people like scum when no one's watching. Maybe there's something I can do? A man like that's bound to have some dirt. I wish Tan and Addison could see it. Things have gotten so bad that Kesh had to literally kick him out of engineering. How literal are we talking here? Boot to ass. Oh, it was glorious. We need him gone, but as incompetent as Spender is at his job, he's insanely good at keeping it. Kesh can tell you more. Pathfinder, I stopped an unauthorized shipment to Kadara. Important stuff. Rations, tools, power cells, you name it. Corresponds with inventory discrepancies. Someone stealing and storing supplies around Nexus and Hyperion for delivery to the Exiles. If you could keep an eye out for suspicious or out of place packages, I'd appreciate it. I'll see what I can do. Great. Stolen supplies haven't been processed for release, so Sam should be able to detect them. Hi. And we're happy to help your guards secure their weapons. I prefer them armed, for now. You understand, of course. Oh, Pathfinder, this is the head of the Angaran delegation. The one who saved the Moshai. She speaks highly of you. Call me Issa de Navarre. Welcome, Ambassador. The Angara's first formal visit will be one for the history books. I wonder what they'll say. I was just explaining to the Ambassador that armed guards aren't necessary here. Is something wrong, Ambassador? Please walk with me, Pathfinder. So much life. All different, all united. The way it could have been. Seventy-five years ago, we were scattered, struggling to rebuild after the Scourge. Then, the Ket arrived. Alien life. It was monumental. But then they deceived and enslaved us. So, I hope you understand my precautions. Your people have endured much, Ambassador. I'd be cautious too. Yet all this, your initiative, is proof there's a better way. I want to believe in this Alliance, Pathfinder. The Moshai says you're trustworthy. Please, help me trust in you. Everything you see, we're willing to share. Knowledge, technology, support. What's the price? Whatever you're willing to give. They'll surrender their weapons to your militia, if that's satisfactory. Thank you. We won't disappoint you, Ambassador. Pavoa said Jav Jaravon, Pathfinder. Welcome to Andromeda. Unlocking. Come on in. Ta-da! My project, she is complete. 
she? Looks like a she to me. Just a proof of concept. I stripped out its remnant command prompts to see if I could power it up myself. It worked! Now I can build a field model with combat protocols that fights for you. So, uh, what do you think? You've outdone yourself, PB. Let Suvian Gil eyeball it, then fast track the combat model for me. I'd hoped you'd be happy. Oh no, I forgot to lock the. Shit. My, my, Pelisaria. Didn't know you were still using this hole. Who's your friend? Kalinda, this is Ryder. Oh, everyone knows the human pathfinder. I meant who's your remnant friend? None of your business, Kalinda. Of course it isn't. That's what makes it so interesting. Don't be so hostile, babe. No reason we can't all be civil, right? Exactly. But you are kind of trespassing, so... Now, now. I was just concerned something might have happened to my dear old friend. I'm sorry for the intrusion, Pelisaria. I'm just relieved to see you moving on. Ta-ta. I'll walk you out. So, want to talk about it? Oh, Kalinda and I go way back. We joined the initiative together. For a long time, we were like family. Now we're not. When you live a thousand years, Ryder, people come and people go. Entanglements are silly. Just like places. Time to pack this one up. I'm done with it. Hey, I hope you know you can talk to me. Anytime. Aren't you a cutie? Thanks, Ryder. That's nice. I mean it. But really, the past is the past. I'm fine. I'll pack up my new pet and essentials. See you back on the Tempest. What's going on? That's your new galaxy. Making speeches about some fresh start while your kids stay frozen. And it's all thanks to your Pathfinder. Excuse me? We've waited months for our families to come out of stasis. They should have gone to your outpost. But since you think research is so important, military personnel got bumped down the list. Like my clan brothers. All the reassignments mean they're in ten different colony blocks now. And my mother just got caught in the middle. I founded the outpost. I didn't decide who would stay in stasis. You don't care that you've torn families apart? That's not what I said. Maybe you could still make this right. I just want Mom out of stasis. That's all anyone here wants. You do stasis revivals. You can tell our leaders you're opening those pods. Today. I authorize whole colony blocks or a few emergency revivals. I can't wake dozens of random people. We don't care whose finger pushes the button. If you can't, our leaders can. And if you tell them, they will. Okay. I'll talk to the leadership about what we can do. Fourteen months of promises. It's time for some results. We tried petitioning Addison. She ignored us. Screw her! Start with Kandros. He sent those ten soldiers over there. Maybe he'll take us seriously. Make them hear. Make them know. Make them lead or make them go. Make them hear. Make them know. Make them go. And John and Shiv. I need to know something from you. Shoot. You've been to Gadara. You've seen the exiles there. They used to be with us, friends, family, co-workers. A lot of us worry about them. We hear it's chaos, but it's dog eat dog. With neither food nor water in sight. It's civilized there. They have rules and systems and infrastructure, just like we do. Oh, good. 
Despite what happened, my heart goes out to them. Thank you for taking the time. Goddamn cliffhangers! Interesting. Thanks, Pathfinder. So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Oh, yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker? <laughs> Shall I deal? Ryder, I can read Bill's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. Don't. All right? You can deal first. Having fun? Getting my ass kicked is what I'm doing. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I, I know, I know, Jill and Gil. The one you mentioned, part of the initiative? Yep, been awake since the start. Jill's a fatality expert, heads of the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home, I bet 50. I call, the CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. Hmm. Sounds kind of disrespectful. It doesn't bother you? Nah, she's like family. Supports me unconditionally. We just ride each other like that. You should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. Ah, I fold. Another one for me, then. Well, that's that. You win. I've achieved my true purpose in life. <laughs> what will I do now? Revenge will be mine. Someday, maybe. Jill predicted you'd be my downfall. Can't wait to tell her she was wrong. Another streak intact, I'll say. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. Those look horrifying. Dutch will love them. Welcome to the Vortex. The flag of Terbuni. Let's hear it. There you are. Looking for the meaning of life? At the bottom of a bottle? You didn't leave a note. We were worried. Well, as you see, I'm fine. Uh-huh. What? I can't kick back? Have fun? Man, no offense. It's just... Just what? You don't seem like you're having fun. <sighs> I grew up on Omega. You'd think I'd know how to drink. What's this really about? PB thinks I don't care about the crew. That you're all just experiments to me. Do you... Is that how you think I see you? Since when do you care what PB thinks? It's not the first time someone told me that. In fact, every one of my exes said something similar. Hence why I'm taking a break from relationships. So that's the real reason you said no to dinner. It wasn't because I'm not your type. Yes, I mean, no. Don't change the subject. Is that how you think I see you? You wouldn't be moping in this bar if you only saw me as an experiment. I don't mope, but you're right. <sighs> Thank you, Ryder. I should get back. What about your wine? I'll save it for another day. It's not the best quality, but we don't have many.
Good morning. Uh, oh, hello, or is it evening? It's Pathfinder Rider. Is it true? Was there an attempt on that traitor Sloan Kelly's life? It's true. Oh, that makes me happy. The thought of her out there with a target on her back. Someday she'll get hers. Someday we all get what's coming to us. If there's justice, her before us. She deserves death. Interesting place, isn't it? Full of smiles and handshakes. Not many soldiers. Even though when politicians make peace, it's we soldiers who keep it. Given our situation, it's smart to show we truly come in friendship. <laughs> though in these times, you should be prepared for the alternative. But names. I know you, Pathfinder. I am Andrachno, a Heskarl with the Resistance. A Heskarl? Centuries ago, Herskal were special forces. We defended colonies, passing our training down via oral history. Few remember us today. I came to learn what the Milky Way knows of such things. I heard your father was part of a similar program, an N7. What have you learned about the N7 program? Human soldiers who trained on exotic worlds. Arcturus, Europa, Rio de Janeiro. They learn to fight in all environments, on little food or sleep, to care for their injured, to lead. Is that accurate? Wasn't your father one of them? He was one of the first N7s. He was proud of that, even though he didn't stay in service. Didn't stop him teaching me and my sister a few tricks. So, you carry a little of that knowledge with you, as well as your Pathfinder skills. N7 training would benefit my people. Heskal training would benefit yours. Perhaps a few war games. Show me how your skills handle the tests of a Heskal recruit. 
Challenge yourself and teach me. A chance to work with the Angaran best of the best? Absolutely. Excellent. I'll activate our training beacons. Finding them can be your first test. After that, I look forward to learning. Thank you for arranging my access to the cultural center. Mm, there's so much to study here. <laughs> ah, it would take a lifetime. I'd enjoy that. All the reading, history, science, culture. Get some snacks, settle into that corner over there. No offense, but I'm starting with the Asari. Oh, sure. But when you get to Elcor Hamlet, I want to know. returning the Moshai to us. I'm glad I could help. Seems your people really cherish her. She is dear to us. By the way, you should know. The head of our delegation is at your cultural center. He'd be honored to speak with you. I don't know about these. Whoa, it's the Pathfinder. It's me. You're the one who befriended these strange new people, these Angara. And now they're here, on the Nexus. How do we know we can trust them? I mean, for certain. Remember, we're the strangers. This is their home, and they've welcomed us. They've earned our trust. I guess. Talk to them. Get to know them. See for yourself. Good advice. I will. They offered to put me on the transfer list for an outpost, but I said no. Showdown on Kadara. Rivals buy for power on the Exile. These are stolen supplies. I'll alert the dock manager. Good that you're here, Ryder. I found something while monitoring comms for the Nexus. Multiple attacks by people called the Three Sabers. They're hitting outposts and supply vessels. The really weird part is they seem aware of our operations, like they're getting intel. Remember the last time you asked for help? I swear on Vetra's favorite gun, I'm not lying or getting you to clean up my mess this time. I put in an official report. They keep saying they'll investigate, then they don't. But you're the Pathfinder. If someone's betraying the Nexus, you have to do something about it. If they seem to know our operations, that could spell trouble. Best to get to the bottom of it. Thank you. I knew I could count on you. Best Pathfinder ever. I don't know where they hide, but I got the nav points for their most recent raids. Maybe the Tempest scanners can figure out where they went. What's up? Team has arrived on the Nexus. I met another journalist, Kerry Tavessa. Yeah, we're running Kerry's series, Path of a Hero. Good stuff. 
I'm mostly on my own, so pretty much anyone who brings me news is welcome. Content is king, and her content is really touching a nerve. Talk to you later, Davis. I'll be here. The Cultural Center requests special dietary instructions for Angaran visitors. Son of a bitch, you played me. Knight? Yes, me. I let you near my son. You're not stopping this. expect. So much violence. Then, after nearly destroying the station, the Krogan asked for more power? Good riddance. Ryder, please! The Nexus doesn't need those computers. But we won't be safe from another Overlord until they're gone. You don't know that. Yes, I do. I sacrificed everything to stop it. An expedition to Eos in the Pythia system has discovered a mysterious facility that authorities are calling a vault. Though not much yet is known about the underground structure, it's believed to be remnant in origin. Noted the sorry scientist, Pelisaria Basale. What we activated in the vault drastically As improved the atmosphere stasis, on the initiative This is make change. them hear, make them know, make them see, or make them go! Andros reports the sniper is ready. Understood, Sam. Sam, such a human name. But you murdered my colleagues. God only knows what happened to my son. Nothing in you is human now. I dream. I bleed. I feel. Like you. I just have a little extra. Until Sam decides otherwise. I'm sorry. It won't let you see. But you're the beginning of the end. <laughs> Ella, I'm sorry. Scourge's presence. Some even feed. Specimens, scans. Our conservation effort can barely keep up. What a wonderful service you've done for us. You've certainly earned your fee. And its gas bladder can expand 300%. Amazing. My model of Helios hey, blossoms with data like thanks to you. Here, please. You have earned this.
Residents are still mourning the loss of Gene Garson. The initiative founder was killed when the Nexus hit the Scourge. An official tribute is planned, though Director Jaron Tan has provided few details so far. Without Gene, we wouldn't be here. But now that we are here, we need to focus on surviving before we can celebrate. Sorry, this is trying to is HNS. Around. Pathfinder, maybe you can clear this up. How can I help? My friend Jory was on EOS the first go-round, barely survived. Now they want him to go back. They're saying the conditions are improved, that... that it's safe now, is it? You can believe the reports. EOS is becoming a livable and sustainable space. Going back to reclaim it will help heal your scars. See, Jory? It's going to be okay. Thank you, Pathfinder. Uh, I'll do that. Tracking enemy activity. Zones 2, 12, 9... So that's what the Ked are up to, transforming people into willing slaves? Now we know why they take so many prisoners. Well, they're sure as hell not taking any more. I need to talk to you about Stasis Revival and those protesters in hydroponics. I see. Maybe I should get the others for this. Protesters have seized hydroponics? They want their families out of Stasis. The outpost on Eos disrupted the schedule. They're scattered across colony blocks, dozens of people. The protesters want this fixed today. The realities of our position are... We can't wake those families. We don't have the resources, and there's nowhere to put them. Then what's the point of all those outposts I've founded? People need more than Space Rider. They need work they're trained for, and we don't have placements for those families. If I just toss them to any outpost with a spare bunk, they become a burden we can't afford. What do you suggest? Leave the families in stasis where it's safe and get those protesters out of hydroponics. They seem sympathetic, but so did the exiles. We can't risk another revolt. Survival is more important than family reunions. What would you do with the protesters? I'd send in a squad and march them out. At gunpoint, if we must. If they resist, a few might land in medbay, but it's better than losing hydroponics. Or the Nexus. Do you think these protests could turn violent? We're all pioneers. Even civilians are tough enough to start something. And interfering in hydroponics threatens our oxygen supply. They know that. These people aren't the enemy. We didn't come all this way to rip families apart. We'll manage the resource squeeze somehow. Your compassion is admirable, but... Guess we're all tightening our belts. You can run a stasis override command from operations. I hope the rest will be that easy. Casualty rate matches projections. How may I assist? What's your take on the state of the initiative? Please consult the AVP interface. It has a thorough breakdown of your progress. And your personal opinion? Your progress thrills me. Make my job obsolete, Pathfinder. I dare you. <laughs> Why do some colonists have a number letter designation? All initiative members do. In the CV file somewhere, anyway. It isn't relevant when everyone is doing everything. I suppose it's like... Uh, caring about a middle name. Do you not know yours? I wasn't aware I had one. Hmm. You were in select company even before you were made Pathfinder. Scott Rider Pathfinder. Specialist designation, A04 Malapa. Hmm. Something interesting? An A and low odds. Hmm. 
Someone's an early adopter. I have a specific person I want brought out of Cryo. Name and designation if available. I heard that the chief engineer on EOS went back into Cryo. There have been a few such requests. The first few months in Helios were disheartening. Now that Prodromos is on track, I want her redeployed. Chief Engineer Grace Lito, designation E-97 Durango. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Another time. Pathfinder. Okay, sending the override command. The stasis pods should start unlocking. You're really doing this? I was at the protest in hydroponics. I thought we'd just get more excuses. But we already lost a year waiting for our families. I'm glad it's time. Things will be lean for a while, with the new mouths to feed. But you're out there. We'll manage somehow. My mom was scared something would go wrong and she'd be awake in stasis all that time. She isn't... It doesn't work like that, but I... Just want her out, so I know. Override complete. Stasis revival triggered on the Nexus. For Jasper K, Griffith G, Hilkvist A, Demerchi P, Kozlov S. There! That's her! This came at a cost. Make sure you cherish what you've got. I will. Thank you. Given new resource allocation, personnel in stasis on the Hyperion may now be required to wait longer. When it's time, you'll have a home to wake up to. I promise. Hello again, Pathfinder. How has the Nexus reacted to the foothold I've established? People are eager to help. The shortages are obvious, but you're turning it to inspiration. Havaral is a draw for the research-minded, despite there being so little established. It remains unusual despite the corrected vault. It may yet be a surprising producer. We shall see. There's so much beneath Vold. Some are calling it beautiful, but not when I'm around. Poetry remains off-limits. While Tate is a master at bringing out resources, there are legitimate concerns about the connections you use to place it. Sloan is established. We need that influence. Tan is livid, of course. Giving the Exiles any concession legitimizes them. Keep an eye on it. There's only so much I can deflect, and only so long as you can promise stability. I have info on a specific sleeper I'd like brought out of Cryo. Did you forget the stink that playing favorites has already caused? Look, you're the Pathfinder. If you've a request for your extended team, that's a request you can make. Access the sleeper records through Brecker's console. It's none of my business. Until you make it a problem for me. Understood? Yes, Pathfinder? What's the deal with your assistant? He's a bit... Spender is an ass. That's one way of putting it. I'm aware that he holds certain prejudices, but so does Tan. And we've limited personnel to draw from. Your people, your problem. Technically, you're my people too. So be the example. How are we doing on the viability front? Aiming for success. It sounds pat, but you're living up to the job. Director Addison? Pathfinder. Pathfinder, do you have just a minute? Hi. The documentary's going great. Your comments really got people talking. Director Tan loved the first broadcast. Sent a contribution for your expenses. Thanks. Hmm. Let's get to the juicy stuff. Scientists are excited about your new outpost, though there are questions about how Prodromos can survive where Sites 1 and 2 failed. My team and I surveyed Eos thoroughly, and even stopped the storms. The rest is up to the outpost. 
but the old threats are gone. Hopefully they can handle any new ones. Facing those risks must be stressful. How do you relax between missions? I read up on the amazing things we've seen. And the Tempest has some incredible views of the cluster. This is history too, these little moments between. Shots of this remnant tech, some narration, that completes an episode. Thanks for stopping. Excuse me, Pathfinder. I don't know where else to turn. My best friend's been missing since the revolts. Tell me. He was involved with a woman who was exiled. She obsessed over him, and I'm sure she kidnapped him. The powers that be don't buy it and don't care. <laughs> they say most likely he went willingly. Love can make us do strange things. He didn't love her. She was just a fling. The initiative has branded him a traitor. I don't want that to be his legacy. I want to clear his name, Sanjeev Clement. The woman was Delaney Roos. She must have taken him to Kadara. I'll see what I can do. I'm in your debt. Find what is it? You're out there, facing the cat. We hear only rumors making them out to be monsters. Maybe they just don't understand us. Do you think peace could ever be possible? The cat seems set in their ways. So it would be up to us to change? If they have their way, they'll change us into them. That's what they do. Oh, I see. We must continue the fight then. Thank you for your time. Psst. What's going on? Why are you whispering? I'm planning a surprise for Superintendent Kesh. She's always complaining that our stock of spirits is tame. I hear Kadara Port is famous for bizarre homebrews. Supposedly pack a powerful bunch. Hoping you can pick some up. And keep it quiet. I'll see if I can find some. Excellent. Oh shit. Shh. Maintenance crews, please report to the commons area. I'll worry about this place if you huh? can't find it. Huh. Then we defend the station. That's all we can do here. You just keep the Pathfinder. Dell told me you saw her arguing with Spender. Pijak's doing his best to throttle my department. How's he getting away with that? Spender doesn't know the first thing about engineering, but he knows how to play people. More importantly, he still talks to the Exiles. I'm sure of it. I just can't prove it without your help. This needs to be investigated. I'm glad someone thinks so. Talk to Kandros. He likely has security footage, some kind of evidence. But you'll have to convince him to authorize release. Nothing more for now. Later. Fix it. Well, those families are out of stasis. I know because we're cutting rations for Apex. My decision's made, Kandros. And now everyone thinks protesting is how we get stuff done. Excuse me. Glad to see you, finally. I hear you've been busy out there. That's one word for it. If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. I was told I should talk to you about the mutiny. I wasn't on the Nexus when it happened. I started reading up on it, but... You know how things get around here. Do you know where Spender was during that time? Why Spender? Wait, you think he might have had something to do with the mutiny? Maybe. Just trying to sort things out. You know, the logs I did look through showed a few discrepancies. I meant to dig deeper. If you're investigating, 
How about I give you access to the security vid archives? Thank you. Anything else? Bye, Kandros. You and me both. Huh, this file won't play. Sam, can you boost the quality? Processing. Playback initiated. Wait, is he handing something over to one of the mutineers? Take this back. It'll help you. Don't I am sorry, Pathfinder. This backup file is corrupted. The audio tracks are heavily degraded. Someone may have deleted the original, and this version was restored during a system-wide reset. Sounds like a cover-up to me. I concur. While I cannot restore any more audio, the location appears to be Kadara. How do you figure? In common parlance. Lip reading. Good job. We're bound to find something there. Let's go confront him. That's okay, Drac. I'll just hang out here. Thanks, though. Hey, Ryder. Taking a stroll? Something like that? I just wandered over from the Nexus myself. That place bores me. It's not the same. There's hope now. Hope is good. I spent over a year stuck there. Well, when I wasn't exploring Eos. And I know things are getting better. More lively. But there are too many bad associations. I probably won't hang out there much. Pathfinder? Path... Sorry to call you in, but this is best handled discreetly. Talk to me. Short version. One of Harry's med techs snuck a relative on board. Woke them up, cut them loose. Turns out, this relative has a rare illness. Not contagious yet, but in the later stages. Does Tan know about this? What? No, absolutely not. Tan's office is an informational sieve. This gets out, we'll have a station-wide panic. Besides, this is a Hyperion matter. My responsibility. That makes it mine too, doesn't it, Captain? Thank you, Ryder. Please keep this to yourself for now. The only way this ends without major losses is if we handle things before the rumors get out. Right. I'll look into it. Good. Talk to Harry. He can brief you on the details. Let's bring this under control before it's too late.
Good you're here. Dunn briefed you? High level only. Said to speak with you for the full brief. Great. Well then, here we go. Before we left, my med tech Charlie helped his aunt sign on to the initiative program. He cheated the screening process? Yeah. She has TH314. Deadly, highly contagious in the latter stages and jumps across species. It was dormant, but flared up when Charlie woke her. He just assumed it was stasis sickness. There's no cure, no vaccine. It's deadly in its final stage, and she's off-grid. She's a problem. What should I know about this TH314? Stage 1 symptoms are similar to stasis sickness, which is what fooled Charlie. Stage 2 is marked by extreme bouts of paranoia. It becomes virulently contagious at stage 3. Airborne, the works. Is anyone else infected? No one so far. According to the test results I received after Charlie left, she's still in stage 1. If she progresses to stage 3, Ryder, it'll be bad. It's a rare disease, but the kind that starts pandemics. Any idea where he's gone? Not long ago, he was assigned to an Apex unit for a mission. Incommunicado at the moment. Charlie had no idea the virus would flare up after stasis. Virology isn't his specialty. She's his only relative. Even so, he should have known better. We need to help her, you mean? Every instinct I have, both medical and human, is screaming at me to help her. Making sure TH314 doesn't spread is the top priority, no matter what. This one isn't going to be easy. Anything else I need to know? Be quick, but discreet. We can't panic the entire station over this. I only have a whole space station to search. Discreetly. Check. Could be worse. She could be off station and potentially infecting the Angara. Try customs first. Even with fake medical clearance, she had to go through there like anyone else. Dr. Carlyle has granted me access to Ruth Becker's profile. The file includes her physical description. That'll be useful. Thanks, Sam. Stopped an unauthorized shipment to Kadara. Important stuff. Rations, tools, power cells, you name it. Corresponds with it. Someone steep. If you could keep an eye. I'll see. Hi, I'm Gia Garson, founder of the initiative. Welcome to the Nexus. Name? Scott Ryder. Hi, welcome to the Nexus. Let me check the database and. Wait, you're already approved. And you're a Pathfinder. Um. Uh, Hi? Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for someone. Have you seen Ruth Becker? Yes, I have. Why are you asking? She's a friend. I wanted to check on her before I head back out. Of course I can help. She said she wanted to catch up with friends. Now let me see. Yes, Ruth Becker. Tried to set me up with her nephew. It was cute. Anything else that you can remember? I restricted her access to the common area because there were problems with her file. I sorted things out, then messaged her to let her know she was clear. Thank you. Restricted access, huh? Sam, can you do anything with that? Yes. I believe I can help you retrace her steps, at least during that time. Pathfinder, I've integrated Ru Ruth Becker was here, Pathfinder. You can trace her with your scanner. Scanner can pick up your scanner can pick up Ruth Becker's movements again. Wonder if I can get this part of it. 
Your scanner can pick up Ruth Becker's movements again. Your scanner can pick up Ruth Becker's movements again. Has Ruth Becker been here? Never heard of her. Excuse me, have you seen Ruth Becker by any chance? I don't know who that is, sorry. Drinks are fizzing tonight. Hi, I'm Scott Ryder. Did you see or talk to Ruth Becker by any chance? Later, Val. You're looking for Ruthie. She was here earlier. Helped me sort out some paperwork. Don't know what I would have done without her. Any idea where she might be? She mentioned checking in on a friend in arms. Taryn, I think. Is everything okay? Charlie's fine, right? It would destroy her if anything happened to him. Everything's fine. I just need to talk to her. All right, then. Well, say hi to Ruthie for me when you see her. Have a good day. Thank you. with anything? Hi, my name's Ryder. You're Taryn, right? Yeah. What's going on? I'm looking for Ruth Becker. Was she here? She was here not long ago. She didn't look so good, though. She did just get unthawed. She's bound to be less than stellar. I don't think this was Stace's sickness. She was nervous, kept looking around. She talked about keeping her nephew safe. She ran off mid-sentence. We were talking about the shuttles. Uh, maybe she went to the docks? I'll check it out. Thanks. Sam, paranoia defines stage 2 of TH314, right? Correct. The virus becomes highly contagious in stage 3. If she gets off the station... The risks of a pandemic increase greatly. Really get medical to check you out. I'm fine. She just took me by surprise. I wasn't expecting her just to attack me. Yeah? Can you tell me what happened here? I was here facing a shuttle when this woman came out of nowhere. She whacked me over the head and took the shuttle. Nearly fried me taking off. Any idea where she went? Uh, I bet she didn't log a destination with control before blasting off. This is crazy. What's going on? Why would she do that? Don't worry. I'll bring her back. Good. Thank you. Anything else you can tell me? I blow torch the hell out of the hall when she hit me. She'll leave her radiation trail a click wide. That's good. Very good. I can work with that. Thank you. Sam, our scanners can track the shuttle's emission trail, right? Suvi confirms. Look, we can contain a colony outbreak if need be, but if she contacts an Angara... Find her, Ryder. Whatever happens, she can't land anywhere near the Angara. In order to expedite your entry, you must already have a yeah. medical clearance. It's amazing. It's about... Convicted murderer. 
pardoned after an investigation by the Human Pathfinder proved his innocence. This is HNS. This is not good. Damned Exxon. Boy, Pathfinder. Today has not been a good day. Why is that? A large shipment of medical supplies intended for the outposts you've started was intercepted by those damned exiles. Scouts confirmed they've divvied the supplies up among their own outposts. I'll see what I can do about reclaiming them. That would be great. Thanks. Maybe when you come across them assholes, you can rectify all this. Ryder, good to see you. Damn shame about your dad, though. I'm sorry we couldn't save him. I'm sure you did everything you could. Yeah, but still, we lost a Pathfinder on my watch. Doesn't sit right. My dad knew the danger. Part of the job. Now I just need to make sure your sister here pulls through. That's all. Writer, is it? William Spender. Apologies if we met before. I meet a lot of people running Colonial Affairs. Running Colonial Affairs? I thought you were the Assistant Director. That's right. Assistant to Addison. So we know who does all the real work. From what I've heard, your hands are pretty dirty. I saw the footage. You were handing something off? What footage? From Gavorkum? Routine business meeting. Whoever you're talking to clearly has an axe to grind. And frankly, a Pathfinder shouldn't be wasting time on a witch hunt. You'd be wise to let this be. Gil wanted you to check in. Uh.
Need something? Need something done? You pro- You know where to find me. Hey there. Hey yourself. Question for you. Shoot. When all this craziness is over, you think you'll have kids? Why is that on your mind? Jill. The best friend I mentioned while I was thrashing you at poker. She's starting the initiative's first repopulation effort at Prodromos. It's all she can talk about. It got me thinking. At the end of the day, this whole thing, the Andromeda Initiative, it... We're basically here to spawn. It took you this long to figure that out? I told you, I didn't really think this thing through. But nothing we do here really matters unless we survive. Jill's right. At some point soon, we better get busy making babies. True enough. Who knew this thing was just a glorified dating service? Oosh. The biological imperative is kind of a bummer. There are other ways to reproduce. It doesn't have to come from a romantic relationship. I guess I could donate DNA, or however it works. You know me. Whatever my gut says in the moment, I do. And I don't look back. My mom says that's how my dad was. I wouldn't know. His gut moved on before I was born. I had no idea. It must have been hard. Hey, I turned out all right. He did his part. Brought me into the world. Maybe that's enough. Thanks for talking, Ryder. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Sam sent me the data on that shuttle. I've set up our scanners to track it. Just say the words. This radiation trail matches the shuttle we're tracking.
there's pirates all over this region. You'd think they'd run out of people to steal from. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. I found something. Radiation is a match. She went this way all right. Deploying probe. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Anomaly on sensors. Probe away. Anomaly found. Anomaly on sensors. Deploying probe. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. something probes launched I found something radiation trail is consistent with previous scans this is our shuttle Anomaly detected. Deploying probe. I found something. Pathfinder. Scans confirm the damaged shuttle trail leads to a landing site on Katara's surface. some Krogan hero. Hero? More like a lucky idiot. Maybe they named the system after him because of the nebula. That bit there looks like a Krogan. 
I don't know. I see it. Now orbiting Gadara. Tracking a remnant architect. The one we fought ended up in orbit? Amazing. I've been keeping this to myself, but I feel the need to be honest. I hate it here. You complain every time we dock here. Why don't you wait on the ship? I'm afraid of missing out. You're not on nomad guard duty? No need. Words got around. Wonder how Sloan will crack down on the Collective. She'll hunt Reyes down right away. Can't say I like either of them. I like Sloan less, but better the devil you know. Something smells tasty. Back again. Excellent.
that initiative, Big Shot, aren't you? Maybe. Maybe not. Do I owe you credits? Ah, you're a playful one. I like that. You could say I'm disillusioned with the Exiles. People here can't be trusted. Sooner stab you in the back than work together. So, I got no love for any of them. They don't deserve you. Damn straight. Outlaws got innovative ways of putting stuff together. I bet a smart one like you could learn a lot from scrutinizing our, uh, stuff. You should check out Outlaw Tech and Materials. Might learn a few things. You remember who gave you the skinny on that. Pathfinder, this was the man the initiative labeled a traitor. His friend seeks proof that he was taken against his will. Relay the record to Director Tan. The least we can do is clear his name. Angara seem cool. They could be allies. But I wouldn't be surprised if they ended up hating us. Damn, I hope they're allies. of the shuttle, stolen by Ruth Becker. All right, be careful and stay away from Ruth when we find her. I'll handle this. Sam can make sure I'm safe, but you're all at risk. I read Harry's brief. That wasn't a soft landing. Not the worst I've seen. Scans find no life signs within the shuttle. Ruth Becker. <coughs> Shuttle's crashed. I think I'm in stage three of TH314. The virus was dormant. I don't understand. <coughs> if you can let anyone near me, I'm going to set the warning voice and bring the shuttle to blow. I'm scared. I'm alone, but I can't take the risk. I'm so sorry. Who's there? No! No, wait! Stay away from me! You can't! Shit. Somebody found her. Took her, maybe. Then it's possible the illness is spreading. Over here. Judging from the area and the beacon, I'm guessing they're not friendly. They won't negotiate.
locked. That's Ruth. She doesn't look good. The research is sound, Pathfinder. The Angara truly are immune to TH314. Let Harry know when we get back. Maybe this will help with a cure or a vaccine. I have TH314. I'm contagious. Don't come near me. Quiet. Human. Let me go, or this one dies. I see an Angara, but all I hear is Ket. Quiet! You know nothing. Your people and the Ket are all invaders. The Rokar will kill you all. You can't let him go. I think he has a sample of the virus. Just... just shoot him. You have a choice, human. Save this woman. Or try to stop me. Sam, scan him. Does he have a sample of the virus? Affirmative. However, it is badly degraded, possibly beyond use. Let me go. Now. You can go. But you put even a scratch on her and you're dead. You're a fool, human. <laughs> Stay away, please. Stay away. I, I don't want to make you sick. Ruth, it's okay. You can't infect me. But I'm in stage three. I know I am. I, I don't understand. I, how? It's complicated and we don't have time. Come on, let's get you back in the stasis pod. Finding a cure might take centuries. Charlie will be dead by then. We'll stuff Charlie in a pod too. It'll be fine. I... I hadn't thought of that. Okay then. Thank you. Suvi, there's a stasis pod here ready for pickup. Follow proper decontamination procedures. You found her. Is she okay? All wrapped up and ready to go. Maybe we'll find a cure for her someday. I hope so. Fresh batch of Kadara's infamous home-brewed ale. What'll it be? Bottle of your hardest stuff. This is for Superintendent Cash. Make it six.
Got them all. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. A group of registered criminals has gathered salvage ahead, Pathfinder. This weapon cache was headed for the same location as the first. With more data, I can triangulate the source. This is the location from the Splendor bit, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Anti-vehicular mines ahead. Uh -oh. It's best to proceed on foot. Looks like outlaws. Friends of Splendor? Must have blabbed. Let's get out of here. Quick, get on the shuttle. <laughs> Hurry up! What the? No, 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 wait. Don't leave us. The bastard left us. Of course he did. <laughs> the shuttle left without them. <laughs> what the hell is it now? I guess we fight. <laughs> So Spender's been sneaking goods from the Nexus to these exiles. Why? This Arome seems concerned about something hidden in Spender's apartment on the Nexus. The datapad mentions a scrambler, which would explain the state of the file in the security archives. I highly recommend finding it. So, find the scrambler, nail spender, check. Uh. 
Pathfinder. This area can be mined for resources.